years and countries, but Maine is home to Amelia Dahlin. Here she is with music from her brand new live album, Green Things to Grow. She never wanted something fancy, so give me sweet simplicity. And all she wanted was some quiet and some peace. 4.7 acres was enough for getting by. Dirt was rich enough to satisfy. Life has shown her lemons, but she never seemed to sour. Never was unkind and never dour. But more than herself, she trusted the will of green things to grow. She trusted the will of green things to grow. Lay me down amongst the heather, bury me here when I die. All I'm leaving are some tired bones behind. But more than herself, she trusted the will of green things to grow. Colin, Seth, Kate, Amelia, Dolan. Thank you guys Hi. for coming in and Thanks playing for, for us. us. I appreciate it. Of course, that song, Green Things to Grow, I was reading, it's sort of about transitioning in life. Oh, I feel like, well, there's transition and there's presence, and I feel like, I don't know, at its essence, it's about things will continue to grow and happen, especially in the natural world. There's a climate change kind of connection there and mm -hmm. our ability to um, let things happen despite I don't know, our, 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 uh, our thwarting of the natural world, what's happening, things will continue to happen. It's really more about people and our strife that it's, am I making sense? Yes, of course. <laughs> and that said, you are um, a self-proclaimed activist <laughs> and, and music is sort of a way for you to connect with your community. What do you hope people take away from your music? Oh, what a great question. I think, um, you know, always a sense of comfort and connection. Um, I think music is one of the things that gives us the ability to, to feel like we're not alone. Um, and so that's a big piece of it. And yeah, I, I think that's connection is a big one. 
This is fifth album for you, but the mm. first time you've done a live album. What yeah. went into this? Oh my gosh, a lot. <laughs> so um, we built we built a venue essentially. A friend lent an industrial warehouse space, and we built it into a venue for the night. So stage, lights, sound, everything. We filled it with people. We had a big meal, and. Um, and we recorded everything in one night, and these are all previously unreleased songs, so everything on the album is, is new that people haven't really heard before, except for maybe live. A lot of work. Yeah. A lot of work goes yeah. into that. Yeah. And if you want to hear this music live, you can at Space Gallery on Saturday the 18th. Yes. You've got two shows. I do. One, a family-friendly matinee. Mm-hmm, at 3.30. Um, I have a child and love getting out to hear music <laughs> and yeah. I, know, I, I see and feel the need for that in the community and wanted to be able to offer that. So it's fun, it's, this is danceable music too, so I'm hoping people will come out and join us and dance and th that'll be a little bit of a shorter show and then the evening show will be extended with all, all, of, all of the work. And, all in. Yeah. You guys are yeah. champs to, to come out for two shows in a day. <laughs> We're looking forward to it. If you want to yes. see them, Space Gallery on Saturday. You can find more information in the 207 section of our website.